Right now, we are facing a man-made disaster of global scale. Our great strait in thousands of years is climate change. If we don't take action, the collapse of our civilization and the extinction of much of the natural world is on the horizon. Time is running out. The amount of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere now is 50% higher than it was in 1900s. The world has become so fragile. When we talk about the greenhouse effect, we are talking about something that affects the entire earth and the entire species. If we don't stop the destruction of our natural world, nothing else will matter. The only way we can solve a problem is by human solution. Our world is undergoing a profound transformation driven by the pressing challenge of climate change. In this documentary, we embark on a journey within the International Islamic University in Malaysia IIUM community to explore the vital intersection of sustainable campus transportation, climate exchange as digitality, and fostering peace, justice, and strong institution as DG60. Climate change refers to the long-term alteration of Earth's climate patterns, including changes in temperature, precipitation, wind patterns, and other factors that impact the planet's climate system. It is a phenomenon primarily caused by human activities, particularly the release of greenhouse gases into the atmosphere. In this chapter, we delve into the general meaning of climate change, its far-reaching consequences, and how each one of us can contribute to mitigating its effects. Some of the IIUM experts have mentioned that climate change is a global crisis requiring urgent action. It is crucial for individuals and communities to understand their role in shaping a sustainable future. And other experts as well say, Sustainable Development Goals 13 and 16 offer a roadmap for combating climate change while fostering inclusive societies. They highlight the importance of individual responsibility and collective action. If we look at uh, climate change from legal perspective, so we have to look at the policies, regulations, and also the, the laws, statutes. Whether we have statutes to prevent the people to do uh, bad actions, which will affect the earth, affect the environment, affect the, the weather. We see some problem, we have to uh, cooperate together. Okay. This is a, the, the, the most important concept, the partnerships to achieve sus uh, sustainable development goals. Okay. I cannot work alone, uh, management cannot work alone, rector cannot work alone. Yes. Uh, we have to, all of us work together, management of university, collegiate level. Okay. We work from the dean, the beauty deans, uh, HOD. Uh, and also uh, lectures and the students as well. So everyone responsible to apply and achieve SDG, not only educated people, not only uh, lectures, not only the management. So you contribute something, we contribute something, together we progress. The nature of the planning of IEM is a big campus, can, and then uh, and our country is hot and humid, not jalan, you know, and it's hilly as well, and uh, the nature of our society not, macam kind of, uh, not. I think our society, our young generation, even us, I don't know, uh, less exercise, and we, we're not like uh, really keen on exercising, especially in the hot and humid weather. So, the only alternative we have is transportation, lah. Uh, kan, to go, go from point A to point B, that transportation we need to use of gas and oil again, uh, again, minyak kereta and also, uh, then again, um, I see some services macam last time dia ada motorbike yang guna electric tu I think that's a good idea but then again, uh, I think uh, there's some effort done but then 
you see the motor electric motor has been uh, apa macam stranded you just left it anyway so it's not being kept well i think uh, the problem of uh, managing management of it and maintenance of it our focus now shift to the iaum campus where the project team uncovered specific student transportation practices peak hours and the environmental impact that contribute to climate change it's time to explore the profound connection between sustainable development goals 13 and 16 and how they play a pivotal role in our project for sdg 13 which is climate action urge is to reduce greenhouse gases emission and address the impact of transportation on the environment. Moving to SDG 16, Peace, Justice and Strong Institution emphasizes the importance of inclusive decision making and regulation to foster sustainable communities. Hence, in this final chapter, we witnessed the innovative solution proposed by the project team to promote sustainable campus transportation and address climate change. This solution range from enforcing policies on vehicle usage to promoting eco-friendly alternatives and establishing partnership with scooter services. Our journey comes to an end, but the impact of our collective actions is just the beginning. By embracing Sustainable Development Goals 13 and 16, we pave the way for a greener, safer and more sustainable future. Let us embark on this path of change, inspiring one another and leaving a positive imprint on our campus, community and the world. Together, we have the power to create a better tomorrow. Let's walk this path of change and shape a future where sustainability and harmony prevail. <laughs>